in the heats and not only that is a novice Steve Locker yeah. actually recorded but the fastest recorded lap to a lad that went out and come back into Carton specifically so he could come over here for this event. Yeah. Drove like a demon, had the most atrocious bad luck with a straw bale. <laughs> what I can say is he actually got the fastest recorded time, beating Joey's lap record. I'm sorry, Joey. One minute, nine seconds. I can't see him anywhere. He's here! He's here! He's here! 
Richard Bell. Although we've been, if you like, assisting in the background, there's been one tremendous amount of work being put in to organise this event. There's two people alongside me here who really have, if you like, spearheaded that approach from, the, from day one. And I think it would be remiss of me if I didn't publicly thank... Come on, folks, we can't. Come on. Put your hood vine out and give us a kiss. <laughs> These two people really have started kart racing here in Peel, and I can assure you, if it's left to the tourist board, this is only the start of a growing sport that comes to the tourist board. which this island is internationally famous for, for, started here 80 years ago. In 80 years' time, I reckon you'll be here talking about the Isle of Man being internationally known for card racing. <laughs> making this event a great success. The one person, one group that I've missed out really and I shouldn't have done is Shell Oil because they too have been marvellous with their support. So to anybody that I've missed out, our thanks and we look forward to seeing you any time of the year because the Cart Association have virtually weekly, monthly meetings up at Jerby. Come up and have a taste of what's going on in the north of the island. You won't be disappointed. And one thing is for sure, you'll be always very welcome in the Isle of Man. Thanks for coming. Just round of applause for the hospitality and the thoughts that have gone behind you. Slowly. see the skid mark coming in there and then